What's going on, Mother Truckers? Welcome to Mother Trucker News. Email us at mothertruckernews at gmail.com. I've had over 40 truck drivers send me links to this, and this is actually really close to where I grew up. And this happened in Lathrop, California, and I grew up in Tracy, California. This was on the I-5 going northbound. Uh, right there, Lathrop is like this speck, this small, tiny little town, right? From Tracy, you pass it, and then you're right into Stockton. And so I knew there was concerns about this because I was getting links from family members and friends saying that there's somebody out there targeting truck drivers. And so I wanted to deep dive a little bit into this and give you guys the actual information. And then after, uh, give you guys my opinion from what I've seen doing trucking news for the last almost 10 years. So, you know, um, Basically, what happened was uh, there was reports around uh, 1230 to 1 p.m. Uh, I-5 northbound that someone put a uh, pistol out of a passenger window and shot a truck driver, which led him to veer off of the highway into a building. And I will show clips of this so that you guys could see of the accident. Now, 37-year-old... Ilkham Shadiv actually passed away a few hours ago from gun wounds. And so police are still looking for information on this, you know, and so far that's all they have as of now. Now, as far as this part of the video, I'm just giving my opinion from just doing news and what I've seen. If you look very closely to the truck, it actually says Patriot on it. And a lot of people don't know. But when they see an Amazon trailer, they automatically think that it is a Amazon driver. Uh, this right here is a owner operator. And for the people that don't know what owner operator is, it's basically somebody that owns their own business and they lease on and they actually pull the Amazon trailer. Now, he was from North Carolina, right, originally. So I don't really think that this is a targeted crime. I, I really think that uh, the driver, they have a big facility out in Tracy, California, and they have an extremely big fulfillment center there. And so uh, possibly the driver was picking up or dropping off and heading up towards Sacramento. And so I really think this is a uh, road rage incident. Now, I'm not saying that the truck driver was in the wrong. I'm not saying any of this. I'm just saying from what I see, it definitely looks like uh, this is a one off incident and I do not believe that truck drivers in this area are getting targeted. You know, uh, definitely my truckers comment down below. Let me know what you think. But so far, uh, that was the detailed information. And I just wanted to give you my uh, just opinion of what I think happened. Again, it could have been the truck driver cutting them off accidentally or not. But sometimes it leads to that. Uh, for people that don't know as well, since I'm from the area, uh, Stockton, really uh and i lived in stockton okay for five years uh, stockton really not a safe place to live and that's my own opinion and if you don't know about stockton california uh, they don't play over there so that's all i got to say about that uh, mother truckers comment down below but yeah at the end of this uh, prayers for the driver you know thank you for uh, moving uh freight across america and just being that 1%, you know, that moves 100% of America. You know, we appreciate you. We love you. Uh, they they give always a lot of media attention to the incident and never take a second to just thank the driver for their job. And so we just want to take a second on this channel to do that. So Mother Truckers, comment down below. Let me know what you've heard. But in my personal opinion, I think it's a road rage incident. <music>